Hello everyone, I'm Comrade Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Point 4, playing as a USSR. So, this, this, is, isn't, this isn't where we left off last time, but it is about five days after, you know, uh, we ended the last episode. Last time we took out Romania with the help of the Axis, and basically made Hungary great again. Now let's go ahead and do a national focus. Now we can't do... Imp I just finished anti-fascist diplomacy. I would like to do improve the Stalin line. But well, we can't be in an offensive war, which we're fighting Turkey right now. I can relocate relo industry, which I want to do eventually. But let's go I want to finish and go down to do a research slot eventually. So, let's do research city experiments. One of our foremost scientists, Kurchatov, has noted that when breaking up of kernels and a kilogram of uranium, the energy release must be equal to the explosion of 20,000 tons of throtiol. We need to harness this power before our enemies to ensure the survival of the motherland, which is great. And let us finish off... Turkey eventually. Now, I have set up some naval invasions. We should be good to go. Should be. Well, they might have a few more days needed. 15 more days, which is fine. And I'm going to pull off you guys. Off the front line so that you can help hold areas when we actually navally invade. So, um, I don't want to risk this. Uh, there's, there's only two divisions there. Can six divisions kill off two divisions? They might be able to. I say that might, just because it was kind of horrendous sometimes attacking yesterday. Uh, we seem to be doing okay here, though. Ish. Okay, we're attacking them, and then they immediately attack me back. Okay. Uh, you can probably help attack this way. Oh, attack that way. There you go. Support the attack there. Uh, we're not winning. Uh, uh, kind of winning here? No. No, maybe not. Hold on. I know how to win here. Just cut them off. And then circle up that way. There you go. Now you'll be able to win. All right, we're doing well. It looks like we have an inv invasion set and going, which would be good. And I'm sorry if my nose sounds a little stuffy. That's because it is. And then Alexander Rado was apprehended by Estonian counterintelligence. God dang it, Alexander! You got to rescue our guy. Just go ahead and send Sergey. And you resume mission when done. There you go. Alright, so we landed, which is great. Uh, go ahead and move the motorized down here. Uh, we should be able to link up with these guys soon enough. You know, just take all this land down here. There you go, I, I really don't care. So we seem to be doing better than yesterday so far. Uh, okay, if they abandon Bursa, I'm okay with that. Are you guys down here? Yes, you are. Great. Go ahead and send your guys down this way, which is probably going to kill supply. Oh, hello. Hello. I do want to address one comment from yesterday, though. Someone said, you know, why is infrastructure... Or I said yesterday, why is infrastructure so bad in the USSR? Well, at least for 1930s Russia, apparently there's there was a lot... There still probably is a lot of forests in Russia. So that's kind of cool. It's, I guess it's better than, um, you know, having just deserts. Even though Russia does have a lot of deserts. Cold deserts. And I guess Kazakhstan has a lot of hot deserts. I don't know. I don't know geography that well. But that's really nice. Seven divisions, very cool. Oh, we want... We landed here, too. Great. You know what? Do that, do that, do that. Oh, we have sign up. Great. Oh, we actually won down here. We're, we're moving. Cool. That actually kind of helps out. Cool. Take take their victory points. They like, shouldn't be able to do that much. They're about halfway to capitulation. We've lost about 100,000 versus their 400,000. And hold on. They just lost about 8,000 more, which is cool. I do have a little thing of uh, Soviet coffee here, so... Kind of nice. Oh, wait, you... Oh, you can get up to 30 divisions, Maxime? You're level 6. Holy cow, look at that. Supply consumption. But that skill? Oh, yeah, that's that's nice. You got a lot of planning speed. That's very nice. That's nice. Oh, now this, this, this is looking good. This is looking... I would say pretty tasty. Oh, actually, we get encircled them, but then we got, we got encircled. Well, that's not good. Oh... Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of this. We're gonna circle those guys, that's pretty awesome. And now supply's gonna be extremely terrible through here. Um, you guys, go ahead and go ham. I know we lost a lot of guys already. Ooh, that's not bad. I wanna send all of you guys over here though.
Oh, I guess we're getting attacked. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, we've lost... Oh, no, we sunk an enemy sub. Great. Alright. Since everyone else seems to be going crazy, I might as well let you guys go crazy. I do want to make sure we're prepared against the Germans, though. I did say we were going to make some more anti-tank, and we will. But I don't have any anti-tank at the moment. Cancel lend -lease. We're still trying to research it. I do want anti-air, because that's going to be incredibly important. But, and this is a huge but, we need some more fighters. I need a ton of fighters. Uh, do that. Let's get some more rubber from these guys. Thank you. Well, even though we need more convoys, too. German Reich formalizes anti-Soviet pact. Well, that does not sound very good for us. Some more Turkish subs. Very good. Yeah, we're going to need a lot more fighters than this. Because we we can make carriers. Oh, and Imperial South Africa won the... Oh. Oh, that's not good. War... Oh. Yeah, we better finish this up pretty pretty darn quickly. And... 12 divisions. We're going to need a lot of divisions. We'll put you on high now. You guys are on medium. We'll put you on low. We shouldn't need the divisions in the east. Oh, we don't have that many divisions, period. Actually, with the Reich, since we haven't taken Estonia or Latvia over, that reduces the number of divisions that we actually need. They don't have that much manpower. They're, of course, only on limited conscription. They maybe Oh, they have way more divisions than me, though. Mm. You know what? I might pull these guys off, actually. Just in case. Just, just, just in case. I don't think we're looking that strong around here. Uh, I'm going to say no to that. You guys, you're going to help defend against Bulgaria and Hungary. Yeah, there you go. And you know what? Oh, wait, hold on. Wow, we're out of guns now? What the heck? Okay, they went to war with Luxembourg. That's a little good distraction for us. I mean, I was hoping that we wouldn't go to war until, like, at least 1940. I guess it's, I guess it's almost 1940, but still. That's, uh, that's not a good for us. That's really not good. And this is disgusting. Like, can we please finish this off? Turkey, you can't live for that much longer, I, I bet. Take Ankara. Uh, you guys, cut these guys off. Come on. Okay, there goes Luxembourg. So, we have to fight the Germans off very, very soon. It's almost 1940. Let's grab some research. That'd be great. Kill those divisions off, that'd be good. Come on, take Ankara if we can. Ah, oh, good, it's been taken. Good. And Turkey's gone, great! How am I going to defend this now against the Germans? That's a good question. That's actually a really, really good question. Because, actually, Italy is in the Allies, which is odd. But the Germ. Oh, we have a bigger board here against the French. Well, as long as we have enough Coast Guards, which I know we don't have at the moment... But, you know, I can pull, probably pull these guys off as long as I hold Turkey. That'll be important, to hold this area. That's the most important thing to do. We will, should have enough divisions. I'm not going to... Oh, I could, you know what, train them for now. Just in case. That'll be okay. So, now, we're going to have to pull... Oh, you're a logistics wizard. Oh, or you can be. That's really good. You guys are going to go ahead and do this. You'll be the full army against the Reich right there. Well, oh, you guys already made it over here. Holy cow, you guys are fast. Right? Or, no, is that not you? What? what are you doing? Why are you guys over here? Hold on. Oh, this doesn't make any sense. Why are they over here? I don't know. Let's just redo it. Uh, don't go through Bulgarian lands. That probably wouldn't make too much sense. That'll be good. I'm definitely not ready for a war with the Germans yet. As you guys can probably tell. You guys are okay. Delete all orders just in case. There you go. How strong are their infantry? The cavalry? Ah, it looks okay. Their infantry, though. Probably looking pretty beefy. Pretty darn beefy. Resistance to occupation? Oh yeah, we have armored cars, so I'm not really too worried about it. Another division, throw them right there. That'll be good. We've... Oh. Oh, and they got other guys down here, too. You know what, you guys? There you go. Another seven divisions can be thrown over here. That'll be good. And I'm actually going to throw you right here. Because I need you guys right here. And then we're going to need someone else to come right there to help guard roads. 
I'd like to see though how much more time we have. Zuka, who needs to lead this army? Nikander? Nikandre. Intelligent stuff? Let's rescue our guy, thank you. We prepared a collaboration government. Uh, commence. Network strength in Lafayette has to be more than 20. Oh, come on, man. 25%. Uh, let's double check this. Seven. Lots of people. Do that. 25%. That's okay. Uh, linguist. I'm going to have you guys work in Berlin for now because I'm going to really need that. Infiltrator, seducer. So, you. Come down here to the greater part of Germany. That'll be good. So let's go ahead. I don't have. I don't even have enough planes right now, which isn't ideal whatsoever. You guys, Asia Minor, hold. Do that. You guys, hold. Uh, do that. Oh wait, no. Go there. Uh, planes right here. Hold. Uh, do that, because you're defending. Naval bombers, you're okay. Crud, this is not good for us. I should have expected an early war against the Germans, though. I probably really should have expected that. And I'm not going to deploy anti-tank until I've, like, I feel like we've got enough stuff. Uh, do that. Yeah, we could definitely use more artillery, but more of that. Please, more aluminum. From, not those guys, those guys are evil. Greece. Why not? Turkey was annexed, of course they were. I was considering, considering annexing or releasing Romania as a puppet, but at this point, I don't think I will. I don't think I will. You guys, go ahead and stop, go home. You, go ahead and stop and go home as well. Just go and repair. That'd be good. U7. If you guys can come up here, that'd be awesome, but I doubt you can. See what happens. Go ahead and get, get started in entrenching yourselves. Ooh, Coast Guards. Oh, there you go. Awesome. That's really good. We're starting this prepared. Can't commence yet. Do more than 25%, which is fine. I believe I told you guys to do this, but whatever. That's fine. Tons of divisions are needed now. Anti air. This does give you a little bit more piercing if you throw on anti-air. But it does take 20... We have a ton of divisions, though. This would really hurt us. At this point, once we get the next batch of infantry out, I will throw out some more guys. Uh, okay, no, eight divisions here. If I have to, I can do it like this first. Take out roads. Oh, we actually can... Oh, we can leave here. Nice. You know what? Send everyone to Leningrad before the war starts, if we can. Oh, our guys can actually leave. That's really good. That's really, really good. You guys. You all are not going to do that. You're all, all these guys, are going to come down to Sevastopol. Not going to come to Istanbul. That's a good thing we took out Turkey. We can actually leave the Black Sea, finally. Our... Alright guys, uh, please tell me you're on the road down here. Oh, it's going to take months for them to get down here. If that's the case, what we have to do... Railroad. I need their speed to be, ins be insanely high. 13. That's worth it. But unfortunately, for some reason, like the AI just auto-clicks it off. Especially when you need it. Control B. Control B. Let's see. Moving towards friendly territory. That's pretty good. Use Control B to toggle strategic redeployment for orders of selected armies. That's not bad. Hurry up, guys, and then research city experiments. Uh, we could. Oh, uh, it's actually probably a good idea to improve the Solon Line right now. So, our western border must be better protected from fascist aggression. The Solon Line should be extended and modernized. Absolutely. And they immediately turn it off. Which I don't understand. Ooh, we got uh, some more political power. Does. Can anyone give me some. Infantry defense. It doesn't look like it. Armor defense and attack. That's not bad. Army reformer. It doesn't look like it. That's disappointing. Whatever. Uh, oh, also, we'll call in Spain, our ally, eventually if they get it. Maybe not. Maybe not. They don't have a lot of things down there. 
If that's the case, that's okay. Um, I want to call in the operative. I, I think he's still glitched. No, he's not. Okay, cool. For some reason, it wouldn't work last episode. I don't understand why, but now it does. But, yeah. Yeah, I need hungry, like, guarded. Except for Nation Francais is done. There, these guys are trying to come out from Asia. And they're doing actually okay. They're doing okay. Actually, they're moving all the way through Kazakhstan already. Or Turkmenistan. One of these stands around here. I think it's Kazakhstan. Improve radar. Great. 1940. Go ahead and boost up my infantry as much as possible so we'll get some of these new guns. New guns are always fun to play around with. I do want to see how much longer we have to wait, though. I wish I could see how far they are done with their uh, focus. Gains Annex World Goal, which is really not good for us. But division for division, we seem to like be okay-ish in some areas. This division here, this tile is going to get hit really hard. What's up? Some of these guys are actually okay. You know what? What if we redeploy this a little bit? That might be okay, maybe? But unfortunately, before we move on, can we do this yet? In progress? Oh, it's in progress. Okay, that's good. We're still doing stuff. We're still doing good, 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 good. Sorry, I'm just taking a while to make sure that we're actually okay. And keep up the strategic redeployment. If I lose Romania, so be it. We can still guard against Bessarabia. You guys are... Oh, some of you guys are almost here, actually. That's really nice. You're almost close to Stalingrad. 5 million manpower. Only 200 factories. That's really not enough time for Soviet Union. Or Actually, that might be enough for the Soviet Union to do welcome to the Germans. But then again, the Germans are pretty strong. Mm, there goes that anti-tank, which we will need a lot of eventually. Go ahead and grab some better artillery. Up, some of our guys are almost in Soviet held Romania. Up oh, and we've almost made it there. Oh, there are three divisions there, three Hungarian divisions. They don't look that strong, but then again, you never know. And I'm guarding against Bulgaria just because Italians they might call them in, they might not. Okay, centralist Australia declared war on Australia. Now that's something I was not expecting. Oh. Imp wow. That's a that's a shade of green. That's definitely a shade of green. I really hope the Allies go to war with the Axis. Which sounds normal, but when you look at our world with Italy and the Allies instead of in the Axis, it's a little odd. Uh, British Empire, Allies, Imperial, Australian, Imperial, Loyalists. Oh good, we're actually down here. We almost have a coherent defense. Almost. We're so close. All of our gay guys, gays, all of our gays, no, all of our guys made it within a two months? That's not bad, coming from Asia. I'm gonna go ahead and grab Sophia. Oh, Valentina, just because she's good at, like, beating people up. She can do, like, espionage stuff. You, on the other hand, can continue helping us with German intelligence. Let's go ahead and come over here. You guys are doing well. Which is awesome. We are definitely gonna research more, th not research, but, you know, do more things with the German AI. If possible. Come on. That's, this is really not a lot of divisions down here. <sighs> Fascist influence. I hope Italy... Oh. Does Bulgaria... Do they never get a focus tree? Hmm. I hope Bulgaria joins Italy, though. That'd be probably the most important thing. i more than certain, though. They probably go with... Oh, they can't do Italy first. Befriend Bulgaria. Ooh, I don't know which way Bulgaria is going to swing, though. That's really not good. Because this line is not looking very strong whatsoever. I need more divisions around here. So if that's the case, I'm going to do this. You guys are guarding that area, which is... Well, actually... What if... What if instead, you guys came up here... Just in case, since we don't need you immediately right there. And then our tanks come this way. Tanks and motorized, of course. Minus one. Minus one guy right here. 
What about that? Because they're not guarding roads. Actually, they're not guarding roads at all because they don't need to. But you know what? That'll make me feel better. And that's what matters. And the Reich immediately goes to war with us. Alright, well, should have been expecting that. Let's get 100 more interwar fighters. Oh, God. That's not good. Well, let's see what happens. They're attacking us with 10 divisions in the center. Against 8 of our divisions. Let them attack. Okay, Vichy Francis joined in. Invite to fact... Greece? Wait, why would I want... Why would you want to join right now? Hungry... So this could be a bad idea. This could be a really bad idea. Hold on. Just because I have nothing guarding around here and the Axis invades. But then again, the Axis doesn't really have... Yeah, they, I mean, they come through France, I suppose, but then they can invade here. That does give us some Greek divisions. You know what? If I need to, I can always poop out more soldiers really quickly. Oh, and they wanted to go to war with me because I already switched things around. Ooh. Oh, that's not good. That's okay. And Hungary's getting smacked. Absolutely smacked right now. Um, you know what? I will help out these guys down here. If we need to pull off, that's kind of okay. Slovakia. Oh! Oh, America! Yeah, I forgot. I did make you communist. Communist States of America. Oh, you have war goals against the British. Full desegregation. Reform the... The Monroe Doctrine. Yeah, okay. Yeah, America, you have only 70 divisions. That's okay. Um, yeah. This is not looking good. I'm probably going to have to pull these guys back. If that's the case, I really don't want to lose these guys. But let's have a fallback line. Like right here. I do not want to lose Bucharest, if possible. So everyone hold. And now you shall go. These seven divisions guarding down a little bit further south are still moving around, which is, you know, whatever. You guys are going to be another fallback line, like, right here. As long as they can't push us first. I have not called Spain in, which is a good thing. I haven't been pushing through here, which is good. Go ahead. I'm going to start retreating some of our soldiers for now. Pull out, pull out. I'm probably going to lose a few soldiers here and there. Um, they haven't been pushing through our part of, well, their Polish territory. Which is, you know, whatever. Uh, they just called all their allies in. That's fine. You know what? I don't really care. Nature Francais, Slovakia. Yeah, yeah. I guess without the Germans focus, having someone to focus on, such as France. Yeah, it makes sense for them to go to war with us immediately. Oh. Oh. Oh, if I invite you in, I do. Oh, I don't know if I should let you in. Just because Japan might go to war with them. They might want Manchuko as a puppet. I really don't like that. You know what I also really don't like? That I left my border completely def undefended against the Japanese who aren't even at war with China. That's so bad. This is so bad. Um, yeah. So if one country in the pact is attacked by the Soviet Union, all members will be called into the war. Well... They attacked me, so that's not going to be too good. Communist China, though. I don't mind calling them in. They've got a couple divi divisions. They won't be attacked very soon. Ooh. Will that blow up world tension by a whole lot more? Not really. Uh, what are some losses like so far? Could call these guys in. Uh, let's call these guys. That'd be okay. We've lost about 9,000. They've lost about quite a few thousand. Actually, are they attacking Greece? No. Good. Alright, whatever. And you guys... Nah, nah. It's, it's not worth it, man. <clears throat> so here's what we're going to do. <clears throat> Excuse me. I want to come in here. I want to circle these two divi these three divisions. That'd be kind of nice. Oh, but we're not at war with them, so... That'd be okay. Let's re retreat a little bit more, guys. That's okay. You guys are doing fine, fine, fine. You're going to hold there for now. Uh, the German line... They keep attacking me here. They're going to pull out some more armor eventually. But they're not doing that well. How many divisions does... Okay, Spain. Spain, you're going to have to do more than this, man. Like, like, you... Oh, you lost... Oh, you have no manpower. I mean, that, I guess that would do it. You know, you have to garrison a whole bunch of stuff, I bet. Because there's probably quite a bit of resistance. Oh, there goes French Syria. Do they have resistance down here? I wish we could see. 
Yeah, I'm not calling these guys in. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, they immediately attack me. That's interesting. Quite interesting. Oh, look at that lag. Oh, that's a lot of lag. I was thinking about going through here, doing something like this. Oh, uh, you know, you guys should probably stop training. You guys are pretty good, but just go ahead and stop doing that. Hungary is really trying to expand, which is fine. Go ahead and leave. That's okay. Oh, they won here? Yeah, no. Yeah, no, I can't afford that. And they're attacking my line a little bit more, which is fine. Yeah, I don't know where the German divisions are. They should have more. Then again, they have a lot. They have more factories than me. How many divisions do they have? Maybe up to a max of 184. Oh, that's not good. Let's go ahead and rearrange this. Uh, aluminum is fine. This is not going to fly. We're going to need to get it from British Malaya, which is fine with me. We got plenty enough fuel. Yeah, we cannot afford this. Good, we seem to be winning. Grab you, help support the attack down here. Ah, there comes some Americans. Very good. You know what, just in case. I'm going to put you guys right here. For now. That'd be awesome. Oh, they actually beat me up here. I don't like that. If that's the case, you're going to do this, and you're just going to come swinging through here. <clears throat> that should be okay. Oh, they have another division there. God dang it. You know what? So be it. Surround Aleppo. These guys should fall pretty easily. I don't know. How, how are we losing? Oh, they must have anti-tank. Yeah, I think they have anti-tank there. No, 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 no. I'm okay. I'm okay. Do they have anti tank? They might have anti tank on their tanks. Maybe. Are you guys. Don't. You don't need victory points. Please, please, please. Hurry up, please. Thank you very much. Um. Hmm. Not really liking this. So, we're going to do like something like this. Front line it from here down to there. It's a little better. More divisions? Oh, good. Another infantry division. Throw you down here on this line. Oh, we're losing this. Galati, please do not lose this area. That would be that would be very, very bad. Is that Spain? Oh, it's Rexus, Belgium. Now, that's something I was not expecting. Oh, they're probably the French. All right, so yeah, this is definitely a more challenging time. Now they're probably going to get more supplies through here, which is really not ideal. Okay, they've abandoned this part of the line. If I can destroy these three divisions, that'd be great. Can we attack here, perhaps? Keep them stationary, keep them stationary. That'd be good. You guys keep these guys stationary as well. Do not let them move. Oh yeah, they're attacking with... Actually, air superiority is looking probably pretty darn bad. How many divisions do we get out soon? Some-ish. Oh, have we lost factories or something? Anti air and light tanks, motorized. Oh, hold on. You got to come up here a little bit higher. Let's make get get even more of this because we need more production, and then we'll grab some more from British Malaya. That'd be good. <clears throat> and keep throwing divisions down here. We need them. Oh, actually, subs. Convoy raiding down here. Oh, yes, please. Good. Keep these guys occupied. Awesome. Kill them off. German pressure towards the Benelux. That's very, very good. Doing well here in Syria. Going to kill off another division in Aleppo because we already killed one division. Greece is looking pretty good. This is not looking very good, though. I really don't like the look of this. But we can guard against that river probably pretty darn well. This part of the front is like actually doing pretty darn awesome. Can we push in, actually, if anything? Can we push them back? Actually, we don't even need to push them back. We just need to attack. They're holding out pretty darn well. We can't do much against tanks. Which is why we need more anti-tank. Again, a little bit more anti-air. That's okay. Hmm. I want more. I'd need more. What do we have here? Oh yeah, we need some anti-tank. Wait, 
Anti-air, artillery, anti-tank. Yeah, do that. That'd be good. And we're trying to make some carriers, too. Oh! Another operative. Great! Seducer, because... Mmm. Kiss, kiss. There's a lot of things going on around here. That's alright. Keep finding more stuff out about these guys. That'd be good. Losses thus far. 125,000 versus double. They lost 200,000 in Germany? God dang, that's pretty good for us. Oh, there's a French Navy down here. That's not bueno. You guys... Engage at low risk. Uh, do not split off. I want to tell everyone to go ahead and just go home. Go ahead and do that. That'd be good. This is looking pretty nice, though. Improve the stall line. Very good. Very good. Uh, claims in the Baltic. Uh, I don't want to open up my area too much further. Oh, Smirsh. Diversify the program's okay. But Smirsh would be very good to get another another opera slot and more counterintelligence. So, Smirsh, or Death to Spies, is a proposed counterintelligence initiative that would serve a dual purpose. Rooting out enemy spies and executing deserters and partisans within the ranks of the Red Army. And remove Trotsky Purge, which will give us 5%... More stability if we didn't get rid of it already. Yeah. Cool. Nice. Three more convoys sunk. That's really good. Seem to be doing okay -ish here. Throw you right there. That's important. Our guys we're still seem to be winning here, which is not bad. Can you attack here? No, you're not even connected. That's just fine. See what happens over around there. We should be able to hold right there. This is not bad. Come on, guys. Kill them off. Very nice. Do that. And circle. Destroy. Uh-oh. We lose a sub. We lost two subs. Okay, the Reich declared war. Netherlands. I have called in the Netherlands as our ally. I don't remember asking them to ally with me. Um, but okay. No, once this finishes, I'm going to send all my spies to Germany. I want them in our faction really badly. They're doing some spy stuff in our area, which I really don't like. Oh, don't lose Bucharest. I cannot afford to lose Bucharest because I do not want the enemies to get too much more fuel. Come on, take... God dang, taking Aleppo takes forever. Oh, hold on, let's hold. Our organization isn't very good. You guys... Uh, even if we took that tile, it still wouldn't be that great. Uh, I believe I told you to hold. Thank you very much. Keep raiding convoys. That's great. The French can't repair themselves or heal themselves up or whatever. Oh, we're getting attacked. You know what? Whatever. We'll just take our more territory. If that's the case, take Homs. Homs. Very good, very good. Keep sinking stuff. I love it. Give him the big sink. No, I still can't win. I thought I told you guys to stop, too. That's fine. You don't need to attack. That's okay. You know, we only have infantry equipment on our guys, so... You know, it is what it is. You guys are getting attacked. We've moved on. The Japanese are... Japan. It's 1940. Why have you not gone to war with China yet? <clears throat> That's okay. Oh, look at more convoys sunk. I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. I'm surprised they're not attacking Bucharest yet. Our line is holding pretty darn well, though, which I'm really, really pleased with. 5 million manpower. I should have seen this one coming. Greater Portugal has uh, joined the Axis. Oh! Oh, yeah, you guys are up here, too. Um... Yeah, you might actually pull one, one heck of a sneaky on them, but at this point, it's probably too late to capitalize on that. Two more divisions are gone. We're getting attacked here. Oh, my goodness. I could pull a thingy right there. You guys hold these guys in place. Oh, the tanks can move fast enough. Oh, yeah, this will be good. You hold them in place. Oh, yeah. You hold all these guys in place as well. Make sure... Oh, they want to attack us. Nope, 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 nope. Throw more divisions on these guys down here. Galati, they've lost 300,000. I've lost 185,000, so be it, whatever. Oh, yeah, this will be good. This will be really good. Oh, no, no, no. I want you to kill these divisions off. Help support the attack there. Another division? Great. Oh, are we, are we attacking... That's okay. Just hold. Oh, um, Andre? Anything? Actually, does anyone have upgrades? I haven't done that all episode, I think. Or maybe a little bit earlier, actually. Just a little bit. 
Uh, two Ambusher for now. Mix it up between that Infantry Expert. That stuff looks okay. Ghost Guards, not really getting invaded too much. And no one has stuff there. That's fine. And at least our subs are actually being used. Usually, when you play as the Soviet Union, your navy isn't that great for me to really care about using them too much. But it's not bad. We're getting attacked by how many guys? Seven, including Panzers, which is hurting our production. Um, armored... Oh, we need more armored cars. That's not good. But we have enough production on them, so do that. Artillery's looking okay. Improved artillery. That's awesome. Let's go ahead and grab some improved infantry equipment, too. Prepare collaboration government. Close. Good, because... I want... Where are you guys at? Oh, you have both down here. Uh, just in case this person gets... We're going to send you somewhere else. Uh, Warsaw. Because I'm going to do a lot of stuff against the Germans if we can. I mean, a ton of stuff. And we get another research... Oh, not research guy, but uh, another operative. That would be amazing. They really want to break across there. Cool, cool, cool. I didn't plan on spending so much time in uh, Syria here. It does take quite a while to beat up the Germans, though. You know what? They want to take Alms. I'm going to attack them right here. Alms, Alms, whatever you call it. Great. Come up here so they can't leave. And the Netherlands is unfortunately gone. But... We did manage to sink a couple more convoys, which looks really, really awesome. Oh, and we're going to need more armored cars. You know what? Just in case. I know this isn't good, but I'm running out of armored cars for now. Switch it back to cavalry because I should have enough guns. Plenty enough guns for now. But we're going to need to focus on more guns very, very soon. But unfortunately, that's all the time for that we have today, my friends. If you enjoyed today's episode, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you all tomorrow as we will struggle with the axis. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.